Ray Robinson sent me the script a couple of years ago for Edith, um, and we sort of knew each other through a film, Electricity, that I acted in, um, which Joe Fisher adapted from Ray's novel. And so through Ray, he learned that I wanted to get into directing and thought I might be a good person to direct his uh, debut script. And so he sent it to me and I just thought it was a really beautiful story and, and one which you know I, I was really sort of excited to, to make and that's how, that's how I came on board. I think, I think short films are really important because they are a showcase of, of, of talent, you know, uh, acting talent, directing talent, producing talent, uh, cinematography. Um, and, and you know they're a, they, they're a gateway for people to, to, to you know to making larger projects features and television and, and, and whatever else um, but also they're, they're just you know they're, they're kind of a, a really pure form of filmmaking because they're not influenced by uh, the business side of it or, the, or you know the, the sort of larger machine that's, you know nobody's in it for profit or or anything and usually it's just a, um, a group of people that, that want to come together and, and are passionate about telling a story. Um, and they're usually just a lot of fun to to work on and to make, and so yeah, I think I think they're they're very important for the industry, and um, yeah, there you go. I think Edith is uh, a story which is is you know every human being goes through in in some form. You know, it's about loss and. And regret, and I think every human being experiences both of those emotions, you know, at some stage in their life, which is why I, I sort of was drawn to it and wanted to tell the story because I think that, you know, it's um, something that I connected with and, and I think that, that everybody does. It was amazing working with the actors. Uh, you know, we were so lucky on this film to get such a high caliber of, of actors, you know. Peter, Michelle, Sai, Elliot, Catherine, Alex, you know, we, 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 were, we had such a good cast across the board. Um, and, um, and I think, you know, I, people say that directing is 70, 80% casting, and, and I would, uh, you know, almost agree with that. I think that, you know, good performances are obviously the bedrock of, of good storytelling, and, um, and we got amazing performances. and. It was a pleasure and a privilege to be able to to work with with actors of that caliber as a you know as, you know being so inexperienced as a director. Yeah, I think you know obviously as a director you're you're there at all stages of, of the project. You're there at the initial inception of the idea uh, sometimes, and then you're there right through you know through every stage so the script stage the the production stage and then the post-production stage and people often say that there's three films that you make there's the script there's the, the film that's shot and there's the film that's edited and i um would wholly agree with that and i think as an actor you know you're, you're just there for one stage of that process which is the filming part and you know often you're not in control of you know you're not, you, you can't be in control control of, of, of the rhythm that it takes on in the edit or you know you, uh, you know you, you're just sort of uh you just do your part in it and, and, and sort of hope for the best in a way. Um, whereas a director, you have that vision in your head and you're responsible for executing that uh, as, 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 as best as, as you can. And so I just, yeah, I just really loved and was inspired by, um, by sort of, you know, being there from the script stage with Ray, talking to him about it, editing it, trying to make it, you know, improve it, you know, casting it, shooting the film and then, you know, making the film in the edit which is kind of where it all happens really you know that you just take the raw footage and, and then build the film in the edit and, and that was as equally uh, as as um, gratifying as the actual shooting so it's just a really great it's just a buzz and it's a really great and enjoyable thing and um, yeah I hope to do it more <laughs> Hi Kathleen, so um, with regards to your question, why did I make the leap to uh, directing? I've just always wanted to direct and I, I started acting when I was a kid and I used to stay behind when I'd finished acting and hang around with the camera guys and ask questions and pester them. And I just always wanted to, to, to sort of make films and um, I just sort of saw it as a, as a natural progression and I'd sort of been acting long enough that I felt confident enough to, to sort of give it a go and so I did. And, um, Edith was was always intended to be a short film. It wasn't. It was written by Ray Robinson, 
it was his first screenplay. Um, he's a celebrated novelist, but this was his first screenplay, and so he sent it to me. Um, uh, we worked, uh, we sort of knew each other via uh, this film, Electricity. So he sent it to me as a short film, and so it was always supposed to be one. Um, and uh, yeah, that's that's why it was a short. Tracy, Lana, hello. Um, why a short film's great? I think short films are really special because they're usually all about the art, if that sounds uh, reasonable enough. Um, you know, there's no, they're usually, nobody's in it to profit or to, you know, for any sort of business reason. It's just about making the project. It's a, everyone sort of bands together, um, usually for very little or for, for, for no money whatsoever, just to, to come together and to make this, this story and tell this story in it and and so it's it's kind of it's it's what filmmaking is all about really and I think that's what sets it apart from you know larger projects uh, and usually they they're a great gateway into making features and, and, and you know bigger projects as well. Whoa, whoa, whoa.